we need to get the biological tissue, the platelets, the growth factors, uh, all those cytokines, things like that in the knee joint to help modulate the immune system and the immune component, the inflammatory component of inside the knee joint, which works very differently than just doing a dextrose prolotherapy solution. Some patients will ask if we combine the two. So if we do prolotherapy and PRP in the same treatment, um, and currently the research is suggesting that if we use high concentrations of dextrose in the syringe with the PRP, we're actually damaging the PRP, causing it to lose its efficacy. And so we don't mix them in the same syringe. Traditionally, or typically, I don't do prolotherapy for the ligaments and then PRP for the joint spaces, just because we know that the PRP also works for the ligaments and does work stronger.